Hi, I'm Dr. Melanie Bone, a medical doctor and cancer survivor. When I was going through my cancer treatments nine years ago, I used to have questions I wanted to ask my oncologist, but I was either afraid or embarrassed. Some of them seemed so silly that I thought I should know the answers. For instance, is it okay to continue to be intimate with my husband during chemotherapy? Or is it true that if you wear those cold caps during chemotherapy, you might not lose your hair? How about, do I need to wear a mask when I go on an airplane? And is it true that when my children get a virus, I should move out of the house? There are many questions that cancer patients, their family and friends have, that they're either too embarrassed or don't have enough time with their doctor to ask. For that reason, I've devoted myself to answering questions, no matter how small, about cancer-related issues. If you go to my website, www.drmelaniebone.com, you will find a link where you can send me questions. No question is too small for me to consider and answer you back. I developed drmelaniebone.com as a personal cancer community. Join me online for all your cancer answers. Hi, I'm Dr. Melanie Bone, a medical doctor and cancer survivor. You know, I find that women patients are often ready to come in and ask me about their risk for cancer, but men don't seem to want to do that. Why is it? I believe that women are more tuned into their bodies and more apt to go for regular checkups like pap smears and breast exams. But men are at risk for cancer as women. Men smoke, and therefore they're at risk for lung cancer. Men have prostate glands and can get prostate cancer. But the stigma of diseases like prostate cancer sometimes make them afraid to go to their doctor. Men are also are at as high risk for hereditary cancers as women are. I often suggest to my female patients that they take their husbands for a trip and on that trip make a suggestion about visiting the doctor when they come home or, as a birthday gift, set them up an appointment with their physician for a regular checkup. The important things for men to check are the PSA, which is a blood test looking for prostate cancer, a chest x-ray to be sure there's no lung cancer, and the screening colonoscopy after 50 years old to look for colon cancer. I developed DrMelanieBone.com as a personal cancer community. Join me online for all your cancer answers.